fish pot. Mm. According to the arrival schedule, there will be a ship arriving from Mondstadt today. The artist for the possible fingers could draw some dumpsters. Should be arriving soon, so let's head down to the docks. Hello, you must be here to take part in the Iridori Festival. We are the festival guides, and we'll show you around. Yes, that's right. We are bards from Mondstadt. Word has it that Inazuma has undergone many changes of late. We hope to find fresh inspiration here. These guests are all bards, aren't they? Well, where's Tonga's bard then? Huh. Strange. He's pretty famous in Mondstadt. Do you think he didn't receive an invitation? Huh? Why's that? Oh, Paimon sees what you're getting at. Even though Vendi no longer rules over Mondstadt, he's still an Archon. If he came rushing to Inazuma at the first mention of a festival, not only would it seem a little childish, it would also sort of be shameless of him, too. <sighs> Mr. Honorary Knight! Paimon! It's Kali! Were you also invited to the Iridori Festival? <laughs> no, Albedo's the one who received the invitation. But because everyone in the Knights of Favonius has been really busy these days, Albedo arranged for someone here to issue me a dependent pass. Greetings, Traveler and Paimon. After hearing that Inazuma was making preparations for the Irodori Festival, I predicted that I might run into you here. It seems that you already know why I'm here. Just so you're aware, I'll be using my pen name in Inazuma, Calx. Oh, by the way, do you know where the International Trade Association is? I'll be meeting with the editorial director of the Yai Publishing House there. Yeah, the International Trade Association is where you'll be staying in Inazuma. We'll be heading there too. Great. Well, let's get going then. Before. <laughs> Slow down, Klee. Please be careful not to bump into others. <sighs> Telling Klee so many stories about Inazuma during the trip was probably not the best idea. As a result, she could hardly sleep all the way here. It appears she's even more excited now that we've arrived. Strange. It seems that the editorial director, Mr. Hiroyama, isn't here yet. I'm certain he said that he'd be sure to arrive before me. This might be a problem. Well, Mr. Hirayama was supposed to meet with me and give me some reference materials about the five kasen today. That way, I could better visualize the content for my paintings. You mean, you had no idea what you'd be painting before you arrived in Inazuma? I only know of the five kasen by name. Because of the sheer age of the tale, very little has been passed down to this day. So Mr. Hiroyama decided to help me collect some more information. I'm the type of painter who can complete a painting quickly as long as I'm inspired. So I agreed on only receiving the details today. So when do the paintings have to be done by? According to the festival plans, 
the portraits will be revealed one at a time throughout the various stages of the Irodori Festival. The first one, depicting Suiko, will need to be done before the festival's official opening ceremony, which is the day after tomorrow. The day after tomorrow? Then you're already running out of time! There's no need to panic. When I was working on light novel illustrations, because the manuscripts are shipped by boat, things were always tight and finished at the last minute. Just last month, to ensure the latest book of A Legend of Sword would be finished for the Irodori Festival, I had to complete the final chapter's illustrations the same day I received the manuscript. I heard that my illustrations were sent to print as soon as they arrived in Inazuma. I still don't know how well they turned out. Uh, Paimon isn't sure if she should feel sympathetic for your working conditions or compliment you on your artistic genius. Of course, I would still prefer to receive any possible reference materials in advance so that I can be better prepared. The editors of the Yai Publishing House will all be around the Outlander Affairs Agency these next few days. Who knows? Maybe Mr. Hirayama's over there, too. We'll take you over there to see if we can find him, Albedo. All right, it's worth a try. <clears throat> Klee, you haven't slept for a while now. Uh, please stay at our residence in the International Trade Association and get some rest. We will be back soon. Okie dokie. Don't worry, Albedo. I'll be on my best behavior. <sighs> this can't be happening. The moment we need to contact Onadera is when he's on special leave. <sighs> Kuroda and I will go back to Inazuma City for an emergency printing run. The demand for this book is so high, though. Even with the emergency prints, it still might not be enough. Despite everything, we're still lucky that we found out today. If this had happened a few days later, then we'd really be in boiling water. Ugh. Hey, do you think that suspicious guy they found in the warehouse has anything to do with this? Well, the editorial director is on his way over there to investigate the situation as we speak. Uh, sorry to interrupt, but... What's going on here? Oh, hey, Traveler. Uh, don't worry. It's nothing, just an internal issue. That's all. How can I help you? I'm looking for the editorial director, Mr. Hirayama. Does anyone know where he is now? Um, uh, Mr. Hirayama is currently at the warehouse down by the harbor. Oh, hold on a second, Murata. Uh, excuse me, but you must be Calx. The one who was invited to paint the five Kassen for the festival? Yes, that's me. My name is Kuroda. You must be inquiring about information regarding the five Kassen. I do apologize, but please make yourself comfortable at the International Trade Association, and I will let Mr. Hirayama know to send you the materials right away. Oh, no need. You guys look super busy, so we can go find him ourselves. Uh, well, uh... About that. Excuse me, but is there something wrong with the latest volume of A Legend of Sword? Huh? How did you know? Since you were all aware that Mr. Hirayama needed to send me some supporting materials, that means the editorial director didn't forget about it. Instead, something urgent must have cropped up. To add to that, despite being aware that I am Calx, you were still unwilling to let me go to Mr. Hirayama directly. After considering these factors, the only reason you would try to stall me is if something happened to a Legend of Sword, which I did the illustrations for. Well, uh... uh I'm very sorry. The situation is just as you said, Calx. I suppose it doesn't hurt to tell you now. 
earlier today, someone spotted a suspicious outlander sneaking around inside the Iridori Festival warehouse down by the docks. So they promptly alerted the Tenryo Commission. The Tenryo Commission was concerned about potential cargo theft, so they contacted everyone who was renting space in the warehouse. It was then that we realized that the latest copies of A Legend of Sword had suddenly gone missing. What? The books are missing? Shh, not so loud. Not only is this book an eagerly anticipated release in the last phase of the Iridori Festival, but the author, Chin Yu, will be personally attending the release party as well. Because of the dire situation, Mr. Hirayama immediately hurried to the warehouse to determine whether the theft was related to that suspicious outlander. I see. It would be a great misfortune if A Legend of Sword would not be released on schedule, and quite a disappointment for Chen Yu as well. If Mr. Hirayama has gone to the warehouse at the docks, then I'll go down to see if I can be of any help. Chen Yu? Hmm. Sounds like a name from Liyue. Albedo, what kind of person is the author of this book? I have not met him personally, but the editor said that he is actually the second son of the Feiyun Commerce Guild family in Liyue. Oh. Do you know him? Oh. That's a real twist! Paimon never would have guessed that Chincho would be publishing a light novel together with Albedo! But enough about that. Chincho would definitely be upset if he discovers his books are missing. Let's accompany Albedo to the warehouse, too. <laughs> 